He got his claws out, bro. She's my wife, Big B. What is good, YouTube? It's your boy LSG Melly, and I'm bringing you guys part two of the Wolf Among Us, bro. Yo, the first episode was fire, bro. I already know they're about to continue it, and I'm very well prepared too. I got my wine right here. You feel me? I got some treats. I got, I got some strawberry, some chocolate strawberries. They they kind of melted right now, but some chocolate pretzels. My girl hooked me up. I really feel like a bad bitch right now, bro. I'm not even gonna lie to you, bro. Like, we really about to vibe out. I got some chocolate-coated cookie, um, what, Rice Krispie treats, all that shit. Yeah, bro, we about to have a good time, bro. Make sure y'all vibing, too. See, I made sure I got wine today because the hard liquor, like the, the, that, 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 that tequila, man. Shit be giving me memory loss, bro. It's probably why I don't remember this game, and I played this shit like twice. <laughs> but without further ado, we about to hop into this thing, guys. If you, if you guys like the content, please like and subscribe, turn the notification bell on. I really appreciate that. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Just um, yeah, that's it. Stay tuned. Yes, sir. We got episode two, smoking mirrors. Who the fuck is this guy with the hat, bro? Who are both of these? Yo, I really, I really don't remember anything from this game. Yo, I gotta stop smoking, bro. I gotta stop Mr. smoking, Toad. drinking. Do something, Big B. Before right, he completely we completely turns up the place. Damn. Whoa, 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 hey, hey! You've got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid cunt? I'm gonna call her a cunt. You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Look, whatever it is, it's between you and Beast. I'm staying out of it. It's not what you might be thinking. I still want to know what Have you're you doing. Seen my wife? Have Definitely you seen some, some weird yeah. prostitution shit. You might, she, she might be one too. Come with me. This shit was crazy, bro. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow. You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. <laughs> no, I'm D. He's done. This chocolate rice crispy tree is fire. <gasps> but he said if all of this ever got back to me, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill more than one. I'm looking for the woodsman. Well, he's not here. Ollie, you're out of paper towels and the... they're gonna string me up, Big B. That it looks fucking bad. It looks really bad, but I didn't do it. All right, I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl named. Fuck, man. This fucking laugh dog. He comes sniffing around this part of town. Wretched fucks in the woods. Need to take that. That right, big baby. What animal was he supposed to be? Creature? What the fuck was that, bro? Well, that's not true. You're like a big ass, brolic ass sperm cell, bro. Ugly mother. Oh, I beat his ass. Look at him tear his arm off. Bro, I'm in a nice robe, son. Bitch, that's crazy. I still can't believe Snow White. What the, f bro? You see how quickly Making life more can be taken away? To be. Where's my subtitles? Like, come on, come on, bro. Get with the program. Yeah, your boy got the nice. I got the robe on. With the. With the um, with the strawberries and the wine, fresh out the shower. 
I'm, re I'm really in my bad bitch era right now. Only thing that's missing is the vibra. What? All right. I'm about to get back on that. And don't, don't say, don't, don't look at me like that, bro. Y'all girls know y'all. That's what y'all be doing when y'all be in, in y'all roll about the shower, strawberries, and y'all be single. Y'all know that's what y'all be missing, bro. Yeah, that, oh, oh that's what y'all be having. If you just cooperate and answer the questions, you can go home. Maybe get some sleep. How are you feeling? Oh. I know it's been a long night for you. You look like you could use some rest. I'll be better when I find who did this, which I can't do while sitting in here. Why am I in we here? We all want the same thing here, Big B. <clears throat> look, I know what you must be going through. No, really, you don't. I do. No, you don't. But I could use your cooperation. You know, I hate to say it, but I don't think you do. Of course. You're you're right. I can't imagine. Like stop trying to coddle right me, bro. Be just like, just ask me a question so I can get the fuck out of here, man. Why am I on video? Like I'm not a criminal. I didn't do anything. What is it with you cops? Always trying to empathize with people. I know this must be hard for you. Do you? Do you fucking know? Have you had a friend killed and their head left at your fucking doorstep? Cat no, got your tongue? Didn't think so. Exactly. So just ask your question so I can leave. Aren't you a police officer too though? Bleeding. Well, what? So good. I was about to say you missed a spot, Blip. Detective Brannigan? I'm Detective Brannigan. Uh, yeah, I know. I, I just said that. Is there something? Do you hear that? <gasps> what the hell is going on? Please. Please. That's all on tape, right? I didn't do shit. I didn't do nothing. We have to go now. You... <laughs> what did you do to her? She'll be fine. It's just a memory wipe spell. Very expensive, but it works. The whole station will forget the last 24 hours and everything they saw at the woodlands. Well, hurry up. But she's gonna wake up on her desk though Make sure y'all wipe that tape. She gonna wake up, see that she was being filmed, re-watch the film, and and and, and see that. Like, hear y'all. Like, bro. <laughs> Yo, they're so sloppy with it, man. Don't try to strike up no conversation with me like we friends, dude. Yeah, ignore this fuck. We, um, we found Tweedledee chained up to a post. That was your doing, correct? Yeah. Well, I don't know why you detained him. D was at the trip trap when Snow was left at the woodlands, so he couldn't possibly be involved in this mayhem. He beat the shit out of me, though. Bluebeard's currently interrogating him, and he hasn't said anything useful. He's working for somebody, and whoever it is wants him snooping around every crime scene I've looked at. That doesn't necessarily mean they're involved in the murders. Him and his brother fucking gang initiated me in the, in the in the corner of an alley bro i had to bring him in anyway i know what you're thinking bigby 
It's been one full night and a slice of morning, and I already miss her too. You treated her like shit, though. You was talking to her mad crazy the last time you seen her. Dies. Now, for it to be snow, I've never been good with these sorts of things. I just can't believe this is really. Yeah, you don't happen. care, bro. Give me a fucking break. What? It's time to break you the silence. You're like the fucking maid, and now <laughs> you want a shoulder to cry on? You didn't care then, and you don't care now. That is not true. Not true at all. I thought we had some common ground, could discuss this like gentlemen. No. Let's get something straight here, all right? We have exactly nothing in common. Everything that connects us is dead. Gone. Exactly, gang. Ichabod I Crane. don't know why I'm asking you, but did she give any indication as to what she was thinking? You saw her last, I mean. I don't know why, but I'd like to know that she was... I guess fine, I suppose. She could come off as callous sometimes, but she wasn't really. She said that she wanted to change things. Make it easier for Fables to get help when they need it. I don't know what else to say, Bigby. We have to, have to put an end to this. It's been two murders in as many days. If we don't unearth our culprit, and soon, there will likely be another on our doorstep tonight. I'll get it done. Please, Bigby. For Miss White. I got it. Golly. I understand his frustration, though. He really liked her. <clears throat> Only person that made That's him feel not a normal. Good answer, is it? Didn't judge him. Just tell me what I want to know. And he had a little Your crush on her. A lot less painful for you, in theory. Oh, Who the fuck is this? On using that? I just thought you really liked rubbing your little sword. What the hell do you think you're doing? Hello, Ichabod. Sheriff. Bluebeard. I was just chatting with our new friend. Bluebeard? You were supposed to wait for us to get back. I told you, <clears throat> if you want to be involved, you will do things my way. First of all, his beard no is violence. black. Whatever you say, Ichabod. His beard is black. Hello, Big B. Where's your brother, I gang? Answers, D. I don't think he's gonna answer oh, me. Oh, goody. I thought you wanted questions, and I was having so much trouble thinking of any good ones. Though I'd settled on, how's your head? You see what I've been dealing with? What are you going to do about this, <laughs> Big B? I'm glad you have a sense of humor. I hope that means you're willing to cooperate. Snow White is dead. Look, I didn't kill anyone. And I'm supposed to just believe you. You were with me when it happened, dummy. He's, he's right. He is right. I still have questions for you, D. I was also with, Sounds um... Like a... I was also, um, getting ready to try to bring in the woodsman as well. So, it, it's neither... It's neither, uh, whatever... Whatever brother this is, and the woodsman. Personal problem. This is ridiculous. Let him work. Um, He's got more experience with these kinds of things. Why were you at Toad's place? Looking for a change of scenery. Thought I might move in. Had to take a look around first, of course. Make sure everything's up to code. And right, whatnot. Don't hit him yet. Don't hit him yet. Right, except <clears throat> for this big hole in the wall. Don't hit him. Matter might of fact, I'm gonna try not to hit him at all. All right, D. Let's get to know each other. What That's... is it now, Big B? Look, I know it's unpleasant. You don't want to be here, right? I'm not trying to make things difficult for you. I just need you to cooperate. Once you've answered my questions, I'll let you go. It would help if I wasn't strapped to a chair. Fair enough. Mm. Just tell me what you were doing at Toad's place. Look, Bigby, we're not on opposite sides here. My brother and I are trying to get to the bottom of things. Same as you. And why are why did y'all beat the shit out of me? Your brother. Where was he last night? I can't Ooh. say. He could have been anywhere. Take your best guess. 
he didn't do it, if that's what you're thinking. Then where is he? No, I'm not sending you after my brother. Look, I answered your question. Can I get my stuff back now? What did you find on him? Oh, uh, nothing of consequence, really. A cigar and a fat stack? Are you done yet? I'm getting old over here. Why did he have whiskey on him? Um. Let's show him the picture of snow, I guess. Fuck, Big B. Don't make me look at that. Just put that away. Please. This is why we're here. Someone killed this woman, and we need to know who. I get it, I do, but I can't tell you what I don't know. So where's your brother? Look, mate, I'd like to help. I would, but I can't tell you where he is. Last time I saw him, we split up, and I went to find Faith. I huh? don't know where he is now, but he didn't kill anybody. You mentioned Faith? Look, I went to her apartment. That's no secret. Yes. You saw me. And you beat no, the shit out of me. It. You said you were trying to fight. Why are you not me? saying nothing about them jumping your ass, bro? All right, D. They was trying to turn what you did crib. You want from Faith? Sorry. <laughs> Yo. I can't help you. I'm not saying any more about it. All right, what but else can I ask this dude, bro? Uh! You know, I really like spending time with you, Big B. You're so pleasant. I don't want to hit him, though. I'll ask you again. Why were you at Faith's? Why is anyone anywhere? All right, let's tighten this. Let's 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 you let's, let's tighten in those. I can barely feel my fingers. Nah, bro, tighten that shit. Ah. Real cute, you prick. What are you doing? Getting answers. I told you to keep yourself under control. Uh, let me handle this. I didn't hit him. L like I really do. As what did you want from Faith? I didn't want shit from that little thief. Thief? More trouble than she's worth. What well, she stole from they you? Didn't say the same about you. Oh yeah? Untie me and see how much trouble I am. She stole from you? She didn't steal anything from me, jackass. It was from my boss. Okay, we got him you talking think again. I got anything worth stealing? Your boss. I don't know you, dude. So let's talk about your boss then. Come on, D. It's clear you're just following orders. So who's calling the shots? No, I'm fucking done. Got something to say? I'll ask you again. Who do you work for? I'm not talking. I don't want to hit him. There's nothing wrong with easing up a little. You need to tell me who you're working for. What can I do to make you more comfortable? I'm not buying this nice guy routine. Looks like your good cup game is played out. I don't want to hit him. <sighs> Can I get you anything? Go fuck yourself. Make him pay for it. I'm about to I'm about to really I'm about to give him a knuckle sandwich, bro. I'm really about to duff his shit. Like he 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 making this hard, bro. I'm trying to leave. I know you want to leave too. I know that circulation is almost gone, bro. You you can't <sighs> I know this must be difficult. Don't even try it, Big B. This isn't working, Big B. I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna try being nice two more times, bro. After that, I'm about to duff his shit. How are you feeling? Oh, come on, D. I'm trying to be nice here. Go fuck yourself. 
He knows more than this. He has to. I'm beginning to think he's just an idiot. He, he told me to go fuck myself twice. How are you feeling? Oh, come on, D. I'm trying All to right. be nice. There's nothing else I could do, Don't bro. Don't even try it, Big D. Amazing how he somehow manages to make this look difficult. I would have cracked him by now if you hadn't interrupted before. I'm about to take your money, bro. You always carry this much cash. I don't like banks. So what? I better get that back. I'll put it down for now. Why don't you just tell me who you're working for? Look, you're not a bad guy, despite what beauty says about you. At least you're not a total bastard anyway. But I just can't give you that information. There's no way beauty would associate with a scumbag like you. What's How the wrong hell with do you me? know beauty? You're telling me I ain't pretty enough? Yeah, we're real close. I thought this was supposed to be a murder investigation, but you're treating this guy like a fucking house guest, Bluebeard! You were making progress before. What is this patty cake shit? Snow White is dead. One of us. And you're going to let this ignorant shit walk out of here in one piece. Out of my way. I'll show you how it's done. <laughs> what the fuck? What do you think you're doing? Teaching him a lesson. Now pay attention. Bro, chill. Stop this right now! You enjoying yourself? Immensely. Bro, he got a chip. You wanna fight? Hell yeah. Uh huh. You don't want none of this, bro. It's not the fight you want, my. Bro, what? I can't anymore, bro. Bro. Who the hell is dead then? Was I put under a fucking genjutsu? Nah. Don't want the white flag. I don't have a white flag, bro, but... Bro. <laughs> nah, son, I need answers now, bro. going on down there Bigby I didn't do anything abusing a prisoner like that I didn't lay a hand on him I wanted to do things the right way but Bluebeard had other ideas I tried to stop him snow yeah that's all, that's all you gotta say Well, yeah. Where the hell have you been all night, Snow? I was working on this case. After a conversation in the taxi last night, I got a call from Toad. He said his son found the body. We thought it was Faith at the time. Getting her back here wasn't easy, but hopefully we'll find something on her to help. Stay quiet, let her talk. Her, or at least to figure out who she is, if it's not Faith's body. Bro, what? No. What is it? I'm glad you're not dead. Me too. I just want to get to the bottom of this. I just feel like 
What is it? I just... I feel responsible in a way. She looked just like me. And maybe that's why she was killed. Snow, it's not your fault. But she looked just like me. Okay, we know that, but... It can't be a coincidence. Somebody had to... We either you have, have a twin sister? And why she was glamoured to look like me. I was just getting ready to go there, the glamour. I mean, that's what it is, right? So, what's our next move? We just keep doing what we've been doing. We do our jobs. And I'm supposed to do what? Sit around the business office twiddling my thumbs? Waiting for the big bad wolf to solve all my problems? That's not what I meant, bro. That's not what I meant. Well, then what did you mean? I told you, I'm tired of sitting around. I'm not going to be an errand girl for Crane anymore. I what? just want you to be careful. Who the hell told you that? I almost lost you once. I'm and... not yours to lose. All right. Yeah, I heard that. I'm sorry. No, 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 no. In the heat of the moment, you said how no, you really felt. But I'm not helpless. I can take care of myself. So that's one thing, bro. You get the truth out of people when they're mad when they're and when they're drunk, bro. And I'm not hers to lose, bro. She don't care about your kid. She don't care. Well, see the anger thing. I don't know. It depends. But most of the time, that's really how people feel, bro. I've been doing it for centuries. And I'm not hearing nothing about that. TJ is waiting inside. TJ is who again? Out last night. Oh, he duh. Tell us much. Nah, who is that again? Now, he just stops talking altogether after a certain point. Oh, Toad's Toad's He's son. Pretty shaken Toad's up, son. though. So try not to be too. My memory you know. is ass. Myself. Right. My memory is so ass, bro. TJ's over there. I don't know if you want to talk to him first or after, but let me know when you're ready to see the body. I... I want to be there. Buffkin, do you have a second? Of course, Miss Snow. All right, let's go inspect some stuff. Trading well, cards. That's appropriate. What is that, hearts? Look at the rest of them. The moon. Usually this is about deception or confusion. But for me, well, who knows? Yeah, what that last one talking about? I hope you can find what you're looking for. The hermit. Yes. Maybe this has been harder on him than I thought. This man got acid reflex. All that, all that cheap wine he been drinking. Where the hell are you going? I I click, I click this. Snow's perfume. Why is that in here? That's not sus to nobody. Sniff it. See if anybody been touching it. You're uh, you're a wolf, right? So check out anyone who fits that profile. You might start with Bluebeard. Right away, Miss Snow. Are you ready to examine the body now? Got to talk to GJ. In a minute. When you're ready. Right. Um. Let's try to let's try to lamp one more time. Maybe he back from vacation. You now, fast this game could have been over if the genie was here. Right, let's talk to the toads. Oh, you look scared. Oh, uh, that's enough. Uh, mirror, vanish, cancel. No. What the hell are what you the, doing? What are they asking in the mirror? What? I wasn't touching nothing. What's going on? Don't worry, no harm done. What were you doing with the mirror, Toad? I thought maybe I'll catch you on the shitter. 
I was just having a laugh. We've been waiting here a long time. Uh, starting the night off with lying. It's all right. Are you ready to talk to Mr. Wolf? It's okay. Are you okay? Go ahead, TJ. I go swimming at night sometimes, in the river. I wasn't doing anything bad. Who was his voice actor? He sounds so familiar. Of course you weren't. We know you're a good kid, TJ. You aren't in trouble, you're my in guy. Trouble. Just tell me what happened. Relax. I was there, under the big blocks, and I heard noisy feet. And when I hear that, I'm supposed to go underwater and stay real still and quiet. Smart boy. That's right, son. Then I saw... I... I saw the lady. It's okay, son. Take your time. Take your time. The lady... fell in. But... but she didn't have her head on. I thought... I thought she was gonna pull me down too. <laughs> cause, cause she had rocks on her feet and she kept falling down in the dark parts. <laughs> Why would they throw her in like a, a lake or a river? To her ankles. Is there more, TJ? Is it true? You know when people are lying? I heard you could do that. That's why you're the sheriff. It's magic. Yeah, it's my special power. Come for them. Make them, make them feel nice. Aren't telling me the truth. Gotta know how to talk Is to the little kitties. Something else you want to say? Please, don't be mad. What is it, TJ? I, I didn't stay under the water. What? I know I'm supposed to, but I was scared, and, and I went to the top again. I couldn't help it. I gave you very specific rules. You have to stay quiet and out of sight or bad things can happen. I told you. Leave him alone, Toad. He's my son. I've set boundaries for a reason. This is a special circumstance. Leave him alone. Right, he's so helping he us solve the case. Underwater. And that's all you care about? I don't know if anyone saw me, but, but someone said, stop laughing. And then I was scared, and I went under for as long as I could. Stop laughing. That sounds like Wait, the... You heard someone? Yes. Why didn't you tell us before? I didn't want to be in trouble. Did you see who it was? No. <laughs> Were those the same words they used? Stop laughing? Try to remember exactly what they said. They said, they said, stop laughing at me. <laughs> Sheriff. Did you hear anything else? No. Okay, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Bigby, he's frightened. Shut up. I just said that's okay, it. Okay, TJ. I'm sorry. After I came up again, there was no one there. And I ran home. That's all. I promise. I want to go home. That's cool. You can go, buddy. Okay. You can go. <laughs> Thank you, TJ. Okay, son. <laughs> Let's get you home. You did a good job, kid. Come on, then. Oh, poor TJ. WTJ. He helped me a lot more than he thinks. That went about as well as I expected. <sighs> you want to go look at the body now? Wait, in a minute. In a minute. Thank you for showing me the mirror, because I almost forgot. When you're ready. Right? Got a couple questions to ask. Hey, 
mirror. Hello, Big B. Nice to see you. Let me see if you'll answer this. What were you showing Mr. Toad and his son? Cinderella selling shoes, Rapunzel, Rose, and of course there's you. And I can't help note that you did not rhyme. Do try to stick to the rules next time. Yeah, I'll do that. Why would you go away? Who said I was done? Um... Where can I find Tweedle Dumb? Uh, that piece of scum. Ugh. Is he looking at me? You look crazy, bro. What about the other brother? The woodsman <clears throat> and I were fighting. Now I want to know where he's hiding. Getting oh, drunk as usual. Fun. Bro, there were other options. I didn't. Let's go see this damn body in snow. Where you at? Are you by the door? Now I gotta go look for her. Where is she? Why are you not? Just go wait by the door. Book of Fables. Are those Tweedle motherfuckers, Tweedle dickheads in the, um, in the story? I will get to the bottom of this. Beauty and Beast, always putting on a show for each other. Seems like not much has changed between me and Woody. They don't even know why they're fighting each other anymore. I meant what I said, Snow. All right. Nah, I'm not. I'm not hers to lose. We shouldn't even worry about her no more. Also, I'd like you to get me some information on this neighborhood watch program that the Mundies have. I believe I already have some pamphlets on file. You want to go look at the body now? Yes, siree. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I almost forgot. Come on. I'm walking mad slow. Yuck. Wow. I didn't realize I've never seen her face before now. Stay quiet. The glamour is so effective, it's invasive. But just do what you need to do. Now, nah, this looks insane, bro. Okay, let's start at the bottom because there's more there's more action going down here. Not right here, you perverts. Rope marks. She was tied up? They tied cinder blocks to her ankles so she would sink. Oh. Track marks. They threw her in a shallow ass river though. Looks or a lake. Pretty heavily too. I hear they only go for the legs if they've used up the veins in their arms or if they're trying to hide the marks. Anyway, it means it's not a perfect match to your leg, unless... Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> unless she out here... <laughs> unless she out here shooting up. Snow, anything you want to tell us, my lady? Her fist is clenched. So she fought back? No marks on her knuckles. Oh, maybe she was grabbing something? 
Maybe. Or maybe she just hasn't. Maybe she can't fight and wasn't hitting nobody. Everybody was wee 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 weaving her shit. Pry it open. Uh, what are you doing? Only way to find out. Investigating, ma'am. What do you think I'm doing? This is exactly why your ass should have been sitting behind the desk. Is it? And that's not even being sexist because there are women who are tough, just like Big B. She's just soft. I know y'all y'all always want y'all probably was gonna try to go the sexist route. Nobody's being sexist, bro. Ugh. Oh, what's with these clean ass marks? Whoever cutting them is really a swordsman for real out here, bro. They've been they've been practicing for years. That's weird. I don't wear a brooch like that. Maybe it really belonged to her. It you took know, Leonardo glamour. Uh, like uh Katana. Buffkin, do you recognize these symbols? No, nothing I've seen before. Wait. If the glamour is supposed to make her look like me, shouldn't it be concealing things like track marks? That brooch, too. Why would it change everything else? I've um, never seen one this sloppy. It might be a cheap one. Just to get the job done. Get the job Witches done for what? what they're doing. That's why they cost so much. Unless someone is making glamours illegally. Get the job it's not done. Technically Wait. Technically illegal, miss. It's not encouraged for sure, but there aren't any laws specifically forbidding it. So there's some sort of black market for glamours? One would assume so. I imagine anyone with access to the proper books and training could theoretically produce a glamour. Yet another thing to worry about. Black market or not, it's a pretty good match. Look at that. The buttons aren't exact either. There's an extra one here. Okay, so what you saying? What you saying? Well, let's talk more about the buttons. You're right. These buttons are wrong. I wonder. I didn't notice it. What? Snow, do you mind if I, uh, Open her coat. Bigby, just let me do it. Yeah, that must be weird. Like, that's like undressing you. You got a thong on. K Freaky Snow. You still okay? At this point, I don't even care how she I feel no more, that, bro. Uh, took longer than expected what have you found out her glamour is defective oh defective we are thinking it's black market we should really be regulating this kind of thing yes we should keep going all right but if you think about it right if you think about it the the real the real glamour costs a lot of money a lot of these fables that are in town just like a regular new yorker can't afford a lot of shit and this is perfect that they have this in new york to show how expensive shit is out here so people are going to the black market so you guys can be off the ass so it's like what do you want them to do spend their last on glamour just to look human but ev um eventually get evicted or get a cheap one and still be able to have some money to pay bills and get get fucking um groceries and all that other stuff like yeah i gotta let up just a little bit bro hmm snow are you wearing lingerie you little freak you are you wearing silk lingerie snow why do you want to know bro i'm investigating the what the fuck do you think not. bro snow starting to piss me all right like i get it she was um huh what is that it's your perfume how do you know what perfume i wear my nose bro this nose. my nose also, i saw the bottle on your desk looks like someone picked it out for her so someone gave her instructions this is weird this is mad it's been weird but like it's getting even weirder 
the more I explore the body, bro. I've seen things like this before. It's definitely magic. The witches don't usually craft objects these days. I don't think it's wise to fool around with that. It's some kind of black market magic. Who knows what it could do? We should have it looked at. Just to make sure it isn't dangerous. Don't you think? Will you keep quiet? You be a mad sus, bro. Huh. What? There's something in here. How do we open it? Nah, he moving weird. Ica nah, Ichabod. I'm not sure yet. Something to do with these rings here. Um. All right. Is was this a deer? Okay. Oh, easy peasy lemon squeezy. What does that mean? Oh. What the hell? That's her hair, dude. In a picture? Is that? It's your hair. How does somebody get close enough to get that? Now, whoever, nah. Somebody a stalker, bro. This is going past stalkerish, though. Someone must have taken this from my apartment. The I apartment. Noticed it was missing, but I didn't think. This was the last picture I had of Rose and me. My sister and I don't talk much anymore. You have a sister? Who did this, Big P? Yo, chat. Can somebody confirm? Can somebody confirm if Snow White had a, a sister in the She's real stories? You gotta be kidding. Ew. I don't have nothing to say. I'm flabbergasted. Who is she? <gasps> Yo, chat. I don't know if you guys remember the last episode. But the guy with the one eye that I beat the shit out of, by the way. <laughs> um, but my fault. He said that the bartender's name. I don't remember her name. He said her sister went missing. And when we got into the fight, the bartender turned into a big ass, nasty ass troll. So either this is the bartender or this is the bartender's sister. Detective work. So I could be a cop, bro. No, I don't want to be a police officer. I would, a, a detective is fine. Yeah, I could that has to be a detective, bro. Wasn't there before. Who do you think she is? I don't know many trolls, I'm afraid. Should have left them all back in the uh, lands. You don't mean that, do you? Maybe Holly knows. Maybe Holly knows. The owner of the trip trap? No, she looks a little... Oh, no. What is it? It's not Holly. It's her sister, Lily. She was reported missing, but I... I guess it just slipped through the cracks. This is exactly what he was talking about. Yeah, I don't care. Unless it's one of y'all. Know something about this? Who Lily was seeing? Well, certainly another troll. What? We should go, bro. You can't go out there. Why Ica not? moving weird, it's too dude. Dangerous. Someone tried to kill you, Bigby. You can't let her go out there with you. You'd be putting her life at Listen, risk. Listen, I don't care Bigby about Snow White no more. I'm Snow not. You're right. I'm me. not in charge of you. I don't want to be in charge of you. I don't worry about you. You ready? You said I'm not yours to lose. So, listen, you're your own woman. You're your own woman. This whole thing is complete bullshit and always has been. I mean, what's his job, really? To keep shit from reaching the woodlands. Jack, I don't know where they are. You're a bar. You're supposed to have darts around. And I normally do, but who knows where the fuck they went to? Who the hell is that? It's a bunch of new people they just throwing in my face. Now, nah, putting a cigarette out on the bar floor is crazy when you was just Come outside, on, bro. Ollie, I need entertainment. Don't look at me like y'all want round two, bro. This'll do. Because y'all know, y'all know what's up. Man said this'll do. He mixy.
Okay, okay, I know. Just relax. I'm not here to start anything. Okay. Miss White, I heard you had kind of a strange morning. It's been kind of a strange morning for everyone, I think. Every time I see this guy, he seems to lose weight. It's amazing. It, it really is. He loses weight and yet somehow keeps all the muscle. Jack. Wolfie, my dear, how are you? Why are you touching me? Who the f*** even are you, dude? Because, you know, we were just talking about you. All of us. At the bar. Here. I just need to talk to Holly. Privately. All right. Just give us a second first. I'm dying to hear about the body that came out of the East River this morning. It was a fable, right? Oh, everyone knows. Tweedledee was just here. He said it looked like Snow White. He's still supposed to be in custody. Crane. Sorry. Tweedledee said you arrested him for no earthly reason. Kept him locked in the cellar all fucking night. He said you tortured him. Which, I don't know, that seems like a breach of your legislative duties. Big B, come on. You can't be so dumb as Jack, to... find the off button, now. This guy what really don't ridiculous? shut up. You and Gran are all, let's get a posse together when there's no one around. But as soon as the big bad wolf walks in, your tails go between your legs. Cat got your nerve. What happened? What happened? I'm tired is what happened. Tired of what? Of trouble, Jack. I'm sick and tired of trouble. Nah, Jack gotta shut the fuck up. Jack. What? Big B, look. Two fables are dead. And shit, Gren's sister. Holly's sister. Holly's sister has been missing for what? A few days now? I let him talk. We haven't heard word one about it from anyone. Actually, have there been any updates? On my sister. Be gentle, bro. Nah, Holly, be direct. Your sister's dead. She's the one we found early this morning. I'm not I'm not being gentle with nobody who was trying to like, remember I was I was fighting and she held my hand. Boy, I sure walked into that one. If you say one more fucking thing, just one more. And she was trying to thing. hide the woodsman. Nah, I'm not being I'm not being gentle with you. Fuck out of here. God fucking damn it! Of course, the dear princess Snow fucking White is all safe and sound. How you mad at Where her? Were you when we reported this weeks ago, huh? Where are you when we ever fucking need you? If you'd give one That's ounce fair. of a shit about her, about any of us, she might have been saved. She might have been cared for. She might have been. Nah, his his anger, his anger is 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 justified. It's justified. All right, everyone, clear out. I ain't leaving her with you. No way. I should have stayed quiet. Holly, get the fuck out of my bar. I just want It should have been you. It should have been you and it wasn't. Damn. Damn. We recovered this from her personal effects. I thought you might like to have it. I I wasn't I didn't even know she still had this. The copper was Be quiet. From a dwarf mine. It's very rare and very old. I didn't even get time to fully examine the whole body. Right. Yeah. Take off for a bit, would you? Are you sure? about her life honestly we didn't talk often <sighs> she was lost here in the city 
She just got swept away by it. Mm. Did she have any friends? Anyone who could tell us what she might have been doing? Why she'd be a target? I don't know about her friends. She hung around where she worked, mostly. She was hooking to pay down debt. Damn, she was a prostitute as well? That way. Damn, that's the only Eventually, way I could pay rent around she here? Over at her work. You know, that shithole club, the pudding and pie. But safe for Georgie the... with all his fucking fees. It's a crock of shit. That's how... I mean, yeah, this is going to be a very controversial topic. But as much shit as people give OnlyFans users, it's way safer than being a flat out prostitute, bro. Like, think about it. You're making you're making money from the safety of your home, doing the same thing you would do by just standing on a corner, re meeting random strangers and potentially like getting anything happen to you. Like, think about it. You being a prostitute, dudes could literally, you know, do what y'all do and they could they could just just decide to not pay you, bro. They could beat you up and leave, knock you out cold, and decide not to pay you. You feel me? But OnlyFans, you're doing what you're doing. You got a bunch of people watching. It's safe. You know who you're acting with. Or if you want to be solo, and you get you can make money from that, like from the comfort of your home, bro, or hotel, wherever you are. So, you gotta think about it like that. OnlyFans, yes. I mean, it's, it's always other ways to make bread, but you got to think about it out of both options. Only fans is looking, you know, looking a little better, you know, well, they kept her under their thumb, really. Holly, it, it's OK. If it's too much, we don't have to do this. George Georgie. Hmm. Not the first time I've heard that name. What do you know about him? We can just go talk to him. We've got a lead. Maybe we can take it from here. <laughs> Lily. Anything else you can tell us? I don't think so. Like I said, we didn't talk much. That's uh, we all out. right. You've been more than helpful. We is out, she? Ski. Where is she? She's at the business office. She's taken care of. I'm gonna have to go down there and get her. Fuck. Please, we can handle the funeral arrangements. No, no, it's it's a kind of it's a formality with trolls. We burn our dead by sunrise, or I don't know. Some burn, old just give her the damn body. It's okay. Your soul up. Of course. Okay. We already didn't go looking Good. for her. Let's go down to the business office and start making the necessary preparations. All right. The first time she smiled. That club. I'll go down there now. See what I can find out from the What's this shit called again? You were good with her. I'm impressed. Really, thanks. It just made everything easier. I'm learning, you feel me? I still don't fuck with you, Snow. You was talking mad hot. You was talking hot as hell just like a few, like a few minutes ago. this Ellen DeGeneres ass look alike oh sheriff what a nice surprise I'm not sure I've seen you here before how you know me You're who is this welcome of course is it business or pleasure or both I'm a friend of Georgie's where is he <laughs> a friend hm. you're in luck he's here come on that didn't even sound genuine, bro. I should warn you that Georgie does not like to be bothered when he's working. And he's in kind of a mood right now. I mean, more so than usual. I don't give a f- I don't much care how he feels about it. You, huh? Like, like come on now. Friends. You said she will remember that. I don't care. He's in a mood right now. Like, I'm not here to, I don't care. 
Like, don't you know? Welcome to the Pudding and Pie. Big bad wolf. Where we cater to the diverse tastes of the Fable community. Your pleasure is our pleasure. Your yeah. desires skip the, are skip, our skip, I don't want to hear this shit, bro. You can skip the spiel. Save it for the customers. Always looking for more customers. Well, I get copyrighted for this shit. Whoa! Okay, we got some... We got some boobies on the doing? screen. You look like you're trying to take a shit. Who's gonna want that? No one's gonna want that. I can take it from here. Good luck. It's your face. You have to smile. You never smile. All right, bro. I'm, I'm gonna have to How censor some of this. I'm really gonna have to censor this. This is insane. Oh, it's you. We're closed. Keep dancing, you. I didn't say stop. Oh my gosh, bro. I'm gonna have to do a lot of censoring, bro. You stay right there. Don't even think about sitting down. I got a few questions. Imagine my excitement. What do you want then? You here for a little taste? Tell you what, come back after midnight, maybe. I can hook you up. Sure. Or, uh, knowing you, she's probably not quite your style. You'd prefer someone who can take a bit of a beating. Tell me, do you prefer a stationary target or one that will put up a fight? You don't know me. You don't know me. Okay, mysterious lone wolf. <laughs> right, I got you. <laughs> All right, this Jesus guy got. Big B, you're so corny. This guy got it, jokes. No, seriously, I love it. <laughs> You don't know me. Okay, all right, Sheriff. Just fucking with you. Look, I know why you're here. Are you sure? Listen, Sheriff. Around here, we can't <clears throat> afford to wait for you and your swanky pals to take an interest. We have to look out for each other. When shit happens, I hear about it. Especially if it concerns my livelihood. In that case, I assume you knew Lily was glamour. Of course she was, you dap git. She was a troll. No, I mean glamour to look like another fable. Yeah? Well, so what? Who gives a toss? People get up to all kinds of things when nobody's watching. It's their own business. It's sick. Ha! <laughs> That's quaint. Especially coming from you. The 13th floor would never provide a glamour like that. It's strictly black market stuff. Ooh, black market, is it? How exciting. This is exactly what I would expect from a thug like you. Storm in, throw around a bunch of accusations, try to scare people. But you've got fuck all to back it up. And we're all just meant to jump any time the wolf shows his teeth. Um. He used to be something, you know. Nothing to back it up? Well, what the fuck is this then? Uh -huh. Get that out of my face. Uh -huh. I found it on Lily's body and it's definitely a back alley job. Where did she get it? You've got this all wrong. If Lily was doing a special glamour, it wasn't for me. For fuck's sake, I want that kind of eat. Who was she doing it for then? She had clients, Bigby. Maybe one of them was into it. A lot of fucked up people in Fable Town. Like who? Try looking in the mirror. Anyway, Yo, now what to do with me? Make one more joke, bro. I'm about to break that shit. Go on then. Oh my gosh, more, more, more censoring, bro. You're gonna hit me? Go ahead. That's what you wanna do, right? That's what you came here for, right? Tell me what I wanna know, or I'll shut this whole place down. He was about to hit me? Oh no, fuck! Yo! Take your sad fucking face where I can't see it. Bloody bastard fucking shit. You proud of yourself, mate. Proud of your little mess. Fuck's sake. Fuck off, hands. I need to ask you a few questions. Hans, 
just cleans up and provides a little muscle when we need it. He's not going to know anything about the girls and their clients or any of that. No one knows. Don't you get it? It's by design. Discretion is our guarantee, right? And the way we guarantee that is that no one knows anything they don't have to know, including me. I cover my eyes and take my cut. End of story. Why not look it up? What's that? Isn't there a little book with all the stuff about the girls and all that written in it? You're a fucking moron! Show me. There is no book. And as for you, Hans, we need to work on your communication skills. You see how and big he is, bro? What the hell start? are your little ass gonna do? Hey, that's my personal property. <laughs> sure, go ahead. Do what comes naturally. <laughs> Yo, I love this guy, though. I'm not gonna count. Tell me about the book. You haven't got the slightest clue about anything. I'm I'm being so nice, bro. Hey now. I'm trying to do this good cop thing because since everybody Cup think I'm a mind, menace. Georgie. I want the book Hans is talking about. Hans is confused. Again. Don't even think about it. Look, Georgie, why don't you just tell me where the book is? Can we please not go round and round about this? There's no book. End of story. Bro, if you don't stop, I'm gonna end up breaking something, bro. Do not touch that. You hear me? That's nothing to do with you. There's still time for you to just cough it up. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but there's no Andy Magic book with everything you want to know jotted down inside. All right. I sincerely wish there was. Maybe it would get you off me back. Oh, I see it. Well, well, what's this? Looks like a floor safe. Uh, I wouldn't know. It was here when we moved in. I don't have a key to it. Sheriff, will you come on? Fuck's sake, I've got to open up in a few hours. Now, I'm not going to hit him. That's just going to be proving everybody right. Give it to me. You're a big bad bastard. We get it. Everyone's guilty. Fucking get it. Jesus, you're killing me. I'm begging you. I'll pay you. Am I going to destroy your place, bro? Women are dead. Then quit being a bloody idiot. Come on, mate. Leave it. There's nothing there for you. Oh, if I destroy your DJ, but you ain't gonna have no music for tonight. You might want to stand back. All right, all right, all right. Oh, you, oh yeah, you lucky, bro, because this was my final straw. I was really about to break that shit. Bloody, come on, man. All right, all right. He sounds like somebody, bro. Once again, don't get your hopes up. I can't put my finger on it, anything. It's a kick to the balls for me and my club, so he can be happy about that. He sounds... Is he Irish? Or Scottish? Here. This is Lily's life. Definitely hear an so uh, accent from him, Who's bro. this Mr. Smith? Oh, dear. I'm afraid it might be a fake name, Bigby. Secrecy is sort of how this all works. Even Hans knows that. Bigby. Watch 207. Room number? I don't fucking know. Millimeters, maybe? Don't bullshit me, Georgie. This is your book. Your girl. I'm not their fucking secretary. I give them a stage. I give them music. I provide an erotic venue to attract and retain clients. But let's be clear on something. The girls make the arrangements with their clients, not me. The girls. They're the ones with the Mr. Smiths and Joneses and Mr. X types. Whatever happens outside the club, that's on them. I log the business, take my cut, and I'm out. Now, I've had quite enough of you and your bullying. Excuse me while I call your superiors to make a complaint. I didn't do anything. There's nothing for you to Hello. report, bro. Business office. Um. Stick lip gloss, compact, glitter.
No. Faith, thanks for covering for me tonight. Let's talk before you go over to the apartment. Lily. Mm, okay, her Looks they like were they both okay. saw one of Lily's clients. Got a threesome? Damn. The lock is busted. Lock is busted open. Okay, there was a little. But there isn't even a lock. There was a little tussle. All right. Excuse me. I heard oh, you out there. Thank God you're closed, bro. You're closed. I don't remember ever seeing you here before. I don't pay for sex. I didn't have a reason to come here before. Yeah. You're trying to place me. They used to call me the Little Mermaid. Once upon a time. Does what that help? What the hell? You have legs kind of glamour uh, speaking of little mermaid i just seen the little mermaid movie with no, Holly, Haley. Real. do you like them they cost me a lot imagine spending all that money on on um on legs just to be a prostitute <laughs> uh, my name is narissa i'm trying to be nice bro well Marissa, what the hell what happened to I Ariel? Some questions. Did you get your of name legally you changed? I don't have answers. You'll have to find those yourself. Uh. Did you see Lily last night? You know, where she went or who she was with? We can't talk about work. This is a murder case. I mean, can't. His lips are sealed. Discretion is our guarantee. Other shorty said that same shit. That's how things work here. People keep using those phrases. What does it mean? This is what I need to know about. Lily's last entry. Who's Mr. Smith? Where's room 207? I have to know. These lips. Sheriff Wolf, would you like to make an appointment with me? The way she said that, I'm gonna humor her. Okay. Okay. What would I need to do? Just gotta humor her, bro. I need 150. It's not good to be short. Definitely got a lot of money. This isn't enough, but it's all I've got. I should have took Tweedle f Dickhead's money. Wait here for a second. Tweedle Dumb and Tweedle D. Two oh seven. You'll think of something. Break that door down, bro. The open arms. It's a start. Mm. This is where they met. It's the best clue you you have all night, bro. I hope you find what you're looking for. Should I hope so too? I'm just glad you have clothes on. It's gonna take me a lot of editing to fucking blur your ass out. She was in multiple scenes naked. It's not even that far. Look at the cop, bro. Look at the cop, bro. Prostitution's illegal and he over here. 
tip your hat to me? Wait, was he tipping his hat to me or was he embarrassed? This, this game does a good job at capturing how New York actually is, bro. Because I'm from Brooklyn, so, you know, I could be... I, I think I'm qualified. This is definitely the city, bro. Hmm. Okay. All right, before we ring the bell, let's look. If the rooms are anything like the lobby... They should cut their rates. Thirty-five dollars for a single is thirty-five. A suite is fifty-three. A double is sixty-five, and some other shit. Yo, these are the yo. Imagine they have five-star hotels with these prices. What? I would never be home, bro. Yeah, shit will kill you. I would never be home. I would just be in lit hotels all the time. Eating that good free breakfast. You feel me? They should probably repair that. Bro, people are coming here. People are coming here to blow or get their back blown out and leave. That's it. There's nothing else. Like, they don't need to do this place. This place reminds me of this hotel that's close to my house. If you're from New York, you know exactly what I'm talking about. It's called the Galaxy. And if you're not from New York, search up the Galaxy Hotel in New York, in Brooklyn, New York, on Lind Linden, no, on Pennsylvania Avenue. You're going to see exactly what I'm talking about. That hotel is notorious for prostitution, bringing prostitutes there. There are a bunch of prostitutes who even hang out in the area, bro. Like, this One this place reminds me of that, bro. Oh, and it and uh, if I you. if I oh I work here, okay? I work the front desk. It's to help pay rent. So now you know. I know I should have told somebody, but Beast would lose his mind if you knew. Beauty, I could honestly not care less about this. Do what you want. Exactly. You know, I don't know why I ever expected anything from you. You told Beast you saw me when I expressly asked you not to, and now you say you don't even care? Yeah, I don't Anyways, care. I'm not going to lie, but I'm I don't care. Here. Sorry. I'm trying to turn so, over a new what are leaf. You doing here? Oh, you have a key. Someone else was murdered last night. I heard. The victim was someone who worked at the Pudding and Pie, Lily. She, uh, come around here ever? Oh, oh, yes, the, the troll. I did see her. I mean, you know, we never really spoke, but she came off a tad intimidating. Do you know Tweedledee? Did you know Faith? Ever meet a girl named Faith? Or just maybe hear that name? I might have. I don't know. By the end of the night, it's it's kind of a blur with all the names. Tara, Brandy, Amber, Heather. Sorry. Um. Uh, Have you seen Snow White down here? Or maybe somebody glamoured as her? You know, it's funny. I did see someone who I thought looked a lot like her, but she didn't say anything when she saw me. Even though she knew that I saw her. Okay. I just assumed it wasn't snow and went about my business. Kinda sorta confirms. Oh yeah, ask about Tweedle. Tweedle D yeah, today. ask about him. He Tweedle Dickhead. Passing. Do you know him or his brother? I took out a loan for back pay. It was like our third notice. And ever since then, those annoying freaks have been pestering me for the money plus interest. Why take out a loan from those two? It was from the crooked man. Beauty. You don't know how desperate I was, Bigby. I had nowhere else to go. Look, if this ever happens again, come see me or Snow first, all right? I tried. I'm not gonna lie, a lot of this is y'all fault. I'll date people complain to y'all and that... All right, I'm just gonna go up to the room. Why do you Thanks. keep putting your... Wait. 
cigarette out in the establishment. Sees you, that they at least see you with me, so they know that I didn't let you just wander around by yourself. Five minutes, please. We'll um, no. Beauty. Just be ready to act like I'm trying to kick you out. Why do you guys have like? Hard. There's literally no reason for anybody else Listen, to be here. Baby, Nobody's comfortably I staying you'll here. Be filing some kind of an official report or something, which is fine. It's just that I was wondering if I need to be in it. You might. Do I have to mention my name. I mean, it's it's not like Beast would ever see your report. It's just. It's not much of a report if I start picking and choosing which facts to include. I see. Well, here we are. Which one was it? Like. I'm doing my job the same way you're doing yours, bro. Yo. Somebody getting pound town, going to pound town in this room right here, bro. Can we go in? You know what? I'm gonna let them do what they do. I ain't gonna open it. I ain't gonna open it. All right, this is the room. This is the room key that I got. You gonna check this one first? I don't think there's anything in this room though. Never sure why they have desks in a place like this. If you take your clothes out your suitcase and you put it in the drawer, the health inspectors through here very you're healthy. a serial killer. I don't know. What do you think? Finding what you're looking for. I wasn't expecting much in here. But isn't this why you're here? Why you have the key? No, the key was just to be sure I found the right hotel. This isn't the room Lily was using. Two oh seven. Oh. All right, let's let's just jet straight over there, bro. Yo, let me get away from so this door with the moaning, now? bro. No, the room they met in was two oh seven. Let's just go straight to the room, bro. Whatever they're doing in there is their business. Bro, kick this shit in, bro. You have keys to these rooms? I thought you had a key. Not to this one. Hold on, Big B. I can't just let you go into any room you want. Seriously, what if someone found out? I could get into a lot of trouble. I could just break in the door if you prefer. Like, no, don't. I'll help you. Just don't break anything. Exactly. Well, that's weird. This key is supposed to open every room in the building, but it's not working. Beauty! Ah, shit. Beast? Big B? How did you know she How was here? do this to me? Whoa, no, do, whoa, whoa, no. whoa, whoa, Wait whoa, whoa, whoa. How could you do this? We've been together through everything. I took care of you. I love. It's not what you think. You think Please. I'm trying to sleep with your wife? You're cheating on me with him? No, no, Beast. I promise I'm not. I'm helping him. That's all. I'll bet. I'm sure you help each other. All right, his eyes turn a different color, so he's far beyond talking to him. Normally, he wants smoke, and I'm ready for it. I swear, to God, I'm about to volley him. He better just keep it cool. Let's see if his wife could get him under under wraps, but I'm about to volley. Just great! I know what this place is. Relax, beast. It's not what you think. Stop lying to me! I should have just been quiet, bro. What the fuck is wrong with you? She's my wife! Beast, listen to me. There's nothing going on. I'm not. <laughs> Hey, All right. I uh, guess I finally see you for who you He put are. his hands on me. Stop, stop it. He put his hands on you me. You said you saw her that night. I should have fucking known. I don't want to hurt you, so just calm down and Beast. Okay, yep, he wants to smoke. Let's do what it. What the hell do you think you're doing? Let's get it. You aren't even listening to me. He got his claws out, bro. She's my wife, Big Bang. I told Yeah. Get your ass up. You wanted this, remember? Yeah. Leave it be. This is my fault. Nah, watch out, watch out. Please, no. I don't understand. Woo! 
pressed Y though. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Nah. no, don't hurt him. I'm gonna hit him one more time, bro. He was gonna attack me anyway, I feel like. You ruined everything! Who who Fuck out of here! That's one way to get the door open. Shit! Oh shit, Big B. Don't shit Big B me. What have you done? What is this? Big B. Look what you did to the door. You can't just act like this whenever Stand you- Stand back. You you don't want to see this. Oh, yo, that's a lot of blood. Well, we got the door open. <gasps> oh my God. Don't touch anything. He said stay back. Who's this? Lily met her client here. Why is he still in is beast mode? Stand? Does he still want to fight me? What's yeah, up? Must have happened right here. Jesus. Well, last night? Yeah. I was on shift last night. On shift? Beauty, what? I'm not a prostitute, you idiot. I work the front desk. I... So that's... Did you notice anything out of the ordinary? There might have been some loud noises. I, I, I don't know. I mean, loud noises aren't out of the ordinary. I didn't hear anyone screaming or anything like that, but shouldn't I have? It just seemed like a totally normal night. How is that even possible? How did they get There's away with so much what blood. the hell? Go lock the front door. Keep people out of the hallway. I need you to be sure no one comes in here. This is a crime scene, okay? But just do what he says. Why I'll are you still later. saying but, okay. bro? There's nothing going on. Get out of beast mode before I turn back into wolf mode and then I violate you again, bro. Like Bigby, what kind of a person could do something like this? That's exactly what I'm about to try to find out. I can't okay. believe this. We have a lot to dissect here, bro. Let's just start from where we are. Do all the rooms have these same clocks with the built-in cassette player? I think so, yes. Ooh. Ooh, the flower we picked up earlier. Where'd you get that? Lily had it in her hand, in case there was any doubt over who died here. All right. What is that? It's a book about Snow White, or about the Monday version of her story, anyway. The whole book is about her? Yeah. No. Is she in a glass coffin? This is the part where she's in a deep sleep, but they think she's dead. Hmm. What's it mean? Why mark the page where she's sleeping? The bed. I think he made up the bed to match the coffin in the picture. Flowers, too. He'd have had Lily lie down just like this. You mean just before? In the story, that's when someone comes to kiss her. But what's the point of killing her, Sorry, though? Mr. Smith. I'm so lost. Why creepy. kill her? The coffin and, and a weird fixation on snow. What the hell is wrong with this guy? Bro, this is weird, dude. Why kill her? All right, we got all the evidence out of here. What's uh, ashtray? It's a huff and puff. I thought you were the only one who smoked that crap brand. Apparently not. Huff and puff. God. Man's put a, a lingerie thing over the wind over the dang, bro. He brought wine. Classy. The bro didn't. Damn, bro. 
I want to. I don't know how to articulate what I'm trying to say right now, bro. M. Oh, we got the we got the cassette. Bet. We gonna put that in the in the thing in my bob. Someone's been rough with this dress. It's torn. Oh no, she must have been wearing it. He killed her and then and then he took it back off. No, there's no blood on it. It must have been torn some other time. What? What are you thinking? He could be a cross-dresser. Yo, what? This is the same dress as the one in the book about snow. I think Smith was dressing Lily up in it to recreate the snow from the book. You're right. It's the same dress. It fits. He's acting out scenes from the book. Girl, she couldn't have known. She probably just needed the money. She could have been anyone. Why is he still in beast mode? Yo, yo, chat. I think you want to fight, bro. But just how does a person? Sounds like there was a series of choices involved. I'm sure she'd have done things differently if she knew where things were headed. Yeah. She must have been so scared. I bet she was, bro. This is insane. Do you smell something? No, just apple. Huh. And there's a bite in it. Oh no, there's more? What? What now? It's got a single bite taken out of it, like in Snow's story. Oh no, do you think it was poisoned? It wasn't. I'd have smelled that. I think it's just a prop. It's here because they were acting out the scene in the book. Bro. Of course. That makes perfect sense. This is sick, bro. He's just acting out another part of the book. God, I can see the whole picture now. It, it all goes together like you said. This creep put that girl in the Snow White dress and, and recreated the whole story from the book with the apple and, and the deep sleep and everything. You're a better detective than I thought you'd be. Thanks. So he planned it all out. <laughs> yeah, thanks for all what? the details noted down. Only then, when it comes time to kiss her and wake her up. Yeah. I hope you're just about through. I don't really want to stay in here any longer. You could have walked out anytime you were ready. You're not even helping me search any. Like, I don't need help. What we got here? Why was that under the rug though? Did, was that? Bro, whoever this is, is insane, bro. How do you know? I'm in this one. It was taken last winter. Oh no, Bigby. This kind of stalking? It doesn't just stop by itself. Trust me, I know about this firsthand. He'll keep trying to get closer and closer. Who the hell? Stand in for snow is gone now, so. The next step closer. What is it? It's <gasps> Crane. I was right. I knew it. I knew it was him, bro. And he destroyed the mirror. Bro. I was just about to say something to. I forgot what I was going to say. I should have said it when it was on my mind. Damn. Wow. That's it. It's the no Could be after you now. Good. I am dying to get my hands on that disgusting weasel. Bro. Really starting to like you, Sheriff. You're not afraid to be a complete bastard. Obviously, there will have to be some changes. Oh, hell no. Nah. Hello, Big B. Shotgun? Take care of it, Big B, or I'll take care of it for you. 
Jesus Christ, Big B. Is that you? I can't wait till we get to that. How did you respond to Crane's death about snow? You and 27 per you and 27.2 percent of players accused him of not caring about her well i mean the way he was acting it's obvious he cares a lot about her now but, but the episode prior is like who the hell would have would have expected that how did you treat the murder suspect you and 45.4 percent of players persuaded him to talk it's not that hard to get him to talk bro just look at the like just just explore your options don't be so quick to hit him, even though I really did want to, bro. He was one, oh, go fuck yourself away from me. Mm. Did you let Snow come with you to the trip trap? You and 75.2% of players let her make her own decision. How did you handle Georgie? Georgie Porgy. Georgie Porgy. Is it Porgy or Porgy? Either way, that name is wait eight. Like I don't. He's a grown ass man. Georgie Porgy. F fuck on my face. You and ninety five point five percent of players didn't hit Georgie. There was no reason for me to really hit him, bro. Did you keep punching Beast when he was down? You and thirty eight percent of play. Yeah, I don't care. I don't care what the. I See, only the ones that I. This sounds narcissistic as hell, bro. But only the ones that. I did that don't have high percentage. I don't care. You guys are tripping. Oh, yeah. Wow, bro. All right, guys, that is the end of this video. Wow, bro. Ichabod was acting mad sus, and I had all right to suspect him, bro. Like, bro. Nah. I can't wait to, I can't wait for episode three, bro. I might record that right now, but bro, I got other stuff to record, bro. But that's it, y'all. Without further ado, we about to uh I'm about at the end is make sure you guys like, subscribe, turn notification bell on so you can see when I drop the next episode because it will be out soon, alright? Stay tuned and I'm out. Peace.